Well, I'm Bill Treadwell. I'm a mentor coach for CTA. Uh, became a coach in 2005 and have been on the faculty since uh, 2010. I've trained uh, approximately 140 to 150 coaches. Well, after 38 years in high tech and in senior management positions, I enjoyed mentoring. I enjoyed helping people move toward you know, achieving their goals and removing obstacles to doing that. And so uh, at the time, uh, in 2005, our company was sold to Sun Microsystems. And so then I, a year later, I decided, what am I going to do next? And uh, so coaching seemed to be a natural uh, path for me to go. I uh, had a pretty good network in the front range based on uh, 20 years on a campus of 4,000 people at a company that I had been with for a long time. It was natural for me to become an executive coach because I had you know, many years as, as a senior executive in a very large organization. So uh, my niche was to take that background and experience and then put that into coaching because uh, of that background uh, I naturally attracted people to my to my practice because they knew that I had been there and done that in many res uh, of the situations in which they are finding themselves. The value of the company is it's increased productivity and increased retention of their people and helping to achieve their objectives as an organization by helping coach people to remove those obstacles that may be getting in the way of achieving corporate objectives. There's big payback there. Uh, many large companies that are well known like a Google's and the Microsoft's and others consider coaching one of their top initiatives because it changes the whole conversation of managers being directive as opposed to helping their people grow and come up with the answers themselves through coaching uh, tools and techniques. I think of an example of a CEO that I've been coaching for about five years who had a company that was losing money, had high turnover, and had many issues around the culture of the company. Uh, making, uh, watching him, that individual change and the improvement in the culture and the productivity brought that company to a high level of profitability and they recently sold that company to a private equity organization for a large amount of money. And, this, and also uh, uh, that individual was nominated for a leadership award uh, as a CEO in the greater uh, Denver area uh, uh, and honored uh, more recently uh, with that award over about 450 other people that were nominated for it. So that was very gratifying to me to see that whole growth process over all those years and the, and the breakthroughs that occurred. I'm at the stage of life where many of my peers have retired and I flunked retirement because coaching gave me a purpose beyond typical corporate America uh, executive activity so I can stay relevant and plugged in to everybody in their lives and it's extremely exciting for me.